welcome Pitt fans to the Console Energy Center for tonight's city game. The Pitt Panthers taking on the Duquesne Duke right here on 92.1 WPTS Pittsburgh. I'm Brian Batchel alongside Mark Stremeni. He's in at the top of the key. Over to Ashton Gibbs now. Swung to Woodall in the corner. He's going to take a three, and he hits it. And the Panthers are on the board first. Three to nothing here. J.J. Moore is going to take a long two. Not even close, but Taylor gets the rebound. Kicks out to Woodall. Now Woodall going to take one dribble, three. Front rim no good. Zana with the tip back. 15-10, Panthers. What a pump fake. Nice drive to the hoop. And Burke pins it off the backboard. Falls down with it, though. The nice save. What a block. Here comes Woodall now going all the way to the rack, and he lays it in right hand over Marhold. Gets it to go. 13 on the shot clock, back to Woodall. Woodall gets by Evans into the lane, puts up a right hand off the glass, no good, but Ken Burks with the tip in. Woodall gets a high screen from Taylor, keeps the dribble alive, five to go, puts up a crazy circus shot, right hand, no good, rebounded by Woodall, and Taylor with the putback slam as time expires. Lamar Patterson, the skip pass to Gibbs for three, Gibbs, nice it. Woodall on the right, free throw line extended. 15 on the shot clock. J.J. Moore is going to take a three in McConnell's face, mm. and J.J. Moore, bucket. <laughs> Brings it to the right side, a handoff to Jones. Jones worrying left side now on Gibbs. A backdoor pass to Montero for the flush. Woodall kicks out the Gibbs, wide open for three. Automatic, Ashton Gibbs. Over to J.J. Moore. J.J. Moore almost takes the three. Instead pulls up for two, tries to force a foul. Can't get it, but Nasir Robinson with a ridiculous hit. Here comes Woodall into the break. The alley-oop to Taylor in the slam. Oh. Pitt leads it by 10. Woodall has ton of fled on him now, the big man. Gets into the lane, kicks out to Patterson for three. Patterson drills the three. Now Panthers finally get across the timeline. Nasir Robinson jumps down to Taylor for the jam. Ashton Gibbs dribbling out the shot clock. So the Panthers, if it wasn't without struggle, they really uh, had some issues with the Duquesne press. Turned it over over 20 times. And the buzzer sounds. Pitt's going to get out of here with a win. 80-69 to over the Duquesne Duke. They move to... 79, or I'm sorry, 49 and 31 over the Dukes in the all-time city game series for Mark Germenti. I'm Brian Batcho. Panthers improved to 6-1 and one on the season. The Dukes fall to 4-3. and three. Next game for the Panthers will be this Saturday against the Tennessee Volunteers.